Welcome to a lesson by the name The Risk Agreement, also referred to as Tenancy Agreement or The Risk Contract. Risk can simply be defined as an estate in road which shows ownership in a stipulated period in relation to the risk agreement. So, in case of a risk, it is based on specific time or a certain duration of time. So, it is not it is temporal in nature. So, it is temporal ownership. This agreement is formed where the tenant is given exclusive right on the road by the road road in a certain period of time. So, the tenant is giving exclusive ownership of road in a period of certain of time. So, it is possession of that property in just a in in periodic time or in a certain period or in stipulated duration. Ten tenant is required by the radio to make periodic payment as the, the as per the RC agreement. So when the tenant is in possession of the property of the rad road or the premises of the rad road is required to make periodic payment as per the RIS agreement. Note that freehold estate the owner of the estate has the ex exclusive right on the property, meaning that he can do as wishes, for instance, he can sell the part of it, hold of it, or give it. So freehold estate is based on permanent or proprietary ownership of property, where leasehold property, the ownership hold the limited right to enjoy the right of a spirited period of time. So in leasehold property, this is possession of property in a specified period of time, so it is not permanent in nature. Some of the duties of RISA in the RISA agreement is obedient. So the RISA is the rad road in the RISA agreement. So the rad road is required to be obedient. RISA is required not to breach the RISA agreement as per the contract. So the rad road should not breach any of the rule in the risk agreement or in the tenancy agreement or the risk contract as stipulated during the time of the formation of the agreement pay rates, the risa is required to pay rates and taxes attached with the leasehold property. So the rad road is, is required to be paying rate related to the promises which you want to give up to the tenant before giving it to the tenant, it must not have any accrual attached to it and if any the radio should notify the tenant of that accrual quite possession the radio is required to allow the tenant to enjoy peace free his resort property so the radio is required by the risk agreement to enjoy to allow the tenant to enjoy peaceful existence in his premises after leasing it reinstatement the rad road is required to repair the premises in case of any damage. So in case of the, any damage in the risk property, the rad road is required to make dual care and repair that property in order to give conducive environment to the tenant. Suspend rent. The SAR should suspend rent or reduce rent in case the tenant has done repairs on the premises. The rad road is required to suspend or reduce rent based on the nature of the damage which had been caused to the property and the tenant repaired it or reduced the amount of rent which the tenant was supposed to pay in case the tenant make a certain repair on the risk property. Duties of the tenant the risk agreement, the tenant is also referred to as receipt, pay rent. The tenant is required by the risk agreement to pay rent as agreed in the this agreement so the tenant should make periodic rent to the rad road in order to maintain the contract or as per stipulated by the risk contract pay rates the receipt is required or to pay rate and taxes attached with the leasehold property after leasing it so after leasing that property he possess that property so he's he's supposed to pay rates least for that premises after rinsing it. Property return. The tenant is required to put radar in possession on, on termination of risk agreement. So after terminating the risk agreement, the tenant is required to put the radar in possession of 
that property that he, ha he had rent since he is the true owner of that property or he hold the proprietary right of that property avoid sub rent the tenant should not transfer charges of the premises without notifying the landlord so if we notify the landlord about the sub rent it will be not violation of the lease agreement but if he decides to sub rent that property to another person without notifying the without notifying the landlord it is again the tenancy agreement or the tenancy contract or the lease agreement care the tenant is required not to commit waste on the lease property so the tenant is required by the lease agreement not to commit waste or destroy the leased property repairs the tenant is required to make repairs on the premises in case of damages so the tenant is allowed to make repair on the lease property premises in case of damage damages which which will occur in the absence of the rad rod lisa remedy in case of breach of agreement one of the remedy which the lisa can take in case of breach of lease agreement or tenancy agreement is right to sue The landlord can sue the tenant for the remedy in case of breach of the lease agreement. Another remedy of landlord in the lease agreement is injunction. The landlord can sue the tenant for injunction in the lease agreement. Another remedy in the ten of of the landlord in the tenancy agreement is stop continuing. The lessor can stop continuing with the lease agreement in case of breach of any by the tenant. Another remedy of the Rad rod in the tenancy agreement is specific is specific performance. The rad rod can sue the tenant for specific performance of the part of the contract. Maybe the tenant may fail to pay rent. So the rad rod is required by the tenancy agreement to compare the tenant for specific performance, termin termination light. The rad rod holds the right to add the lease agreement through prior notice if need arise. For venture right, it is the uh, it is the landlord right to enter his rent property because of a tenant breach of the contract. Termination of the lease agreement. One way in which agreement can be terminated is through a friction of time. Lease agreements ends when the agreed time lapses another way the lease agreement can be terminated is through notice of termination the lessa and lessee is allowed to edit the lease agreement before time by giving notice to either parties sarada radrod may ask the tenant to sarada the lease to him and if accepted it will terminate the lease agreement Another way in which tenancy agreement can be terminated is through forfeiture. It is the legal right of the landlord to enter the tenant premises if there is any breach of the lease agreement. Frustration is another way in which the lease agreement can be terminated. Termination occurs when something happens on either landlord and tenant and stop them from performing their duty as agreed. Disclaimer is another way in which lease agreement can be terminated it is the right of the lessee to disclaim the lease property can only do so if authorized by statute or rule uh, i think we did not cover some of the rights of the some of the remedy given to or rights given to the lessee in the lease agreement so of lessee in the lease agreement some of the remedy of the tenant in the in case of breach of disagreement one of them the receipt or the tenant is can also sue they look similar to those of the, the, the remedies look similar to those of the lease in the lease agreement one of the remedy given to the to the tenant in the lease agreement is right to sue the tenant can sue the landlord for the remedy in case of breach of lease agreement another remedy which the the second the receipt can take in the lease agreement is the tenant can sue the landlord for injunction stop continuing 
the DC can stop continuing the lease agreement in case of breach by the landlord. Another remedy given to the tenant in the tenancy agreement is specific performance. So, the tenant can sue the landlord for specific performance or part of contract. The another remedy given to the tenant in case of breach of the lease agreement is termination right. The tenant holds the right to add the lease agreement through prior notice. I hope that marks the end of our lesson. Thank you for watching. Kindly remember to hit the subscribe button so that you will not miss out any of my future content like this. In case of any question related to the lease agreement, <coughs> sorry, kindly remember to post it in the comment section or to my email and my WhatsApp number in the description page. Thank you.